If we do a shift, center wheel button, and drag, we go flying out of the building right away because the center of orbit is somewhere in the middle of the model. However, now in an uncropped perspective, if we scroll the wheel a little bit over an object, like I just did on this chair, that becomes the center of orbit automatically. In the past, you could select something and then do this and it would become the center of orbit. Now all you have to do is a little bit of a scroll and that makes that object become the center of orbit. So here I'm just selecting signs to make it easy to select something. It's still not super easy to navigate on uncropped perspective, but the fact that you can scroll and actually move through the model. Previously, you would just zoom in and out in Revit 2018 and prior. So now if you do a little bit of a scroll, it resets the orbit and then as you scroll it moves you through the model. Not only that, but in addition to just hovering over an element, if you just point the cursor at a part of a wall or a floor, it'll pick a point on that element underneath your cursor as the center of orbit. So here I'm trying to turn the corner and it's kind of hard because I don't see the floor and all that's visible is the wall and and the sign. So it's not uh, perfectly intuitive, but it's not too bad either. Here I hover over an end table and now that becomes the center of orbit. So I can zoom in on that a little more and then orbit around that particular element in the design to get a better look at it. So this workflow definitely makes it easier to do design work within Revit.